you can see anything a little different from my last videos other than the fact that I'm like in your face right now I am not in my car but if you watch my videos before you've seen this background before and I don't want to record in here but this just happens to be the best lighting in my house and it is my bathroom yay and yes I still do have the same shower curtain unfortunately um yeah so anyway and my hair excuse my hair guys I like literally just took my hair down from some milkmaid braids because I was gonna record a video that way and I just didn't think it looked right so but I got this little crinkly thing going on over here and I'm recording on my phone so I'm seeing like this weird blur in this side of my screen it kind of looks like it's a ghost but ooh. anyway I wanted to go ahead and do a favorites video and it's not a monthly favorites video because I didn't do one last month so it's kind of like some beauty products that I'm kind of loving right now and kind of some household products too and if I'm whispering it's because my baby is right downstairs and oh downstairs and she is probably going back to sleep with her dad right now so anyway I'm gonna make this video kind of quick I guess we'll start with makeup products right now. So this little thingamajiggy that I'm going to show you is kind of old. Um, it is from the Wet n Wild series. I can get the little thing out. <laughs> I'm having to blow it off because it's so old. I've been using it and half of it's gone. But this is the Sandcastle. 396. I think they still have this palette in the store. But oh god, it's so dirty. Look at it. But these colors are really, 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 really pigmented. I tend to use um this these two a lot right here, as you can see, because it's like a gold color, like a really sparkly gold and a sparkly brown. And I love this palette and like I said if you want to go buy it it's Sandcastle 396 is the one from the Wet n Wild series and I actually saw um, makeup by Tiffany D talking about these and they're very 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 pigmented she was just discovering these and I'm like these palettes are awesome so check out some more of them anyway this next thing, and I've actually been using this for a very long time, and it's half gone too, so this looks disgusting right now, but it's the Age Rewind Concealer. You guys have seen this before. This is one of the best concealers I've ever used in my life. And to be honest, this is probably my first concealer because I get dark circles now, and I feel like it started when I was 30, to be honest. I never got dark circles before that until I turned 30, so. But anyway, I'm going on 34 now, so. I've had dark circles for four years, and there's that little thing in my hair doing that again. But anyway, the next beauty product I will show you is one of my highly favorite mascaras right now. And that is the Mega Plush Volume Express Mascara. Mascara. Um, I'm pretty sure this has been talked about on YouTube, but I actually first saw this, and I'm mentioning her a lot, I noticed. I saw this on um, Ingrid, Miss Glamorossi's video, and she was talking about it. And I was using the falsies before, and I still love the falsies, but this is awesome. I have no eyelashes, I wasn't blessed with that. But this makes it look like I have eyelashes, and look at this brush. This brush is awesome. And you can see, well, you probably can't see on this video, but it kind of makes it look like I have eyelashes. You can kind of see from there. So, if you want a really good mascara, either this or the falsies. 
are my two favorites. The next makeup product is this. It's by L'Oreal Paris in these eyeshadow palettes. And this one's actually called Amber Rush. And this one's awesome. I'm actually wearing it on my eyes now. I never know how to show my skin. <laughs> it's like... But anyway, you can kind of see it's like a pinkish color. I don't really have a lot of makeup on today. This is like my last one, but it's because I'm off. And I kind of try to stay away from it when I'm off. But this is awesome. And it comes with a little thing in the inside where you don't really want to discard these at all. Because it's kind of, it's not, it's like a powder. So you want to keep that in there. But it's really, really pink and pretty and I love it. This is my first one that I tried from these. I've seen a couple colors that I plan on going back and picking up. So they're really, really nice and very pigmented. The next beauty product is this. And I actually got this from my Birch Box. So that's why it's a little trial sample. But it is the Staymatic Hint of Tint for Cheeks and Lips. And I've used pretty much all of it. It's like a blush. But... You can use it for everything, but here's the brush. Looks nasty, but it's pretty awesome. I like it. It kind of creates a little tint. And of us black ladies or African American ladies, however you want to say it, have a hard time finding a lot of blushes. Don't make us look like just weird, I guess you can say. And that doesn't. So, ladies, you want to try it. It is called Staymatic The Bomb Staymatic Blush. Another product that I like a lot, and this is actually another blush product, and this is the NYC Blushable Cream Stick, and this one is Mulvin Uptown. I know that you're not going to be able to see that at all. No. Okay. Anyway. These cream sticks is so funny. I was just in like Dollar Tree one day and I saw this. And it has like the little tube that goes up. And they are awesome. And it's so funny. I started using these and discovered how pretty they were. And then I saw this on um, Rachel Tablet's video. I probably pronounced her. Probably like killed your name. I'm so sorry Rachel. But they're awesome. And they work really well, and I like cream blushes. And I'm like rubbing my face like, Poop. Anyway, I'm crazy. The last beauty product I have, well, not really the last one, but as far as makeup-wise, and I actually talked about these in my last video, and I said I was going to show the one lip butter that actually worked for me. Here it is. Reron Lip Butter here. And this is in the color of Big Jam. This is actually really nice. And it's in the dark color of Big Jam. And this is awesome. I love it. It actually comes out really pretty on my lips. And like I said before, I'm not really good at finding a lot of lipsticks that work for me. And I was pleasantly surprised with this. So when they say that all the lip butters actually work for all women, I think they are true with that. And I guess this could be considered a um, makeup product too. And this is another one of the Birch Box finds. And if you don't know what Birch Box is, you probably could watch YouTube and there's plenty of ladies out there that will tell you what it is. But it's a monthly subscription that actually sends different trial sizes of beauty products to your um, mailbox every month. I currently am not doing mine anymore only because I just... I don't know, I want to try some new ones, but I still love Birch Box, and I probably will sign up for it again, but this is the Chlorine um, Soothing Eye Makeup Remover with Cornflower Water <laughs> for Sensitive Eyes, and it is parabens free, and I like it. Now, I honestly haven't found a lot of makeup removers that will work for me. I was trying the um, Neutrogena makeup wipes, but it actually ended up breaking out my face, so I had to stop using those. And I've seen a couple of them on YouTube that I'm planning on trying, but as of right now, this is actually pretty awesome. So, 
If you see this anywhere, this is just a trial size, but if you do see it anywhere, try it out. It's pretty cool. That is the final beauty product. But here's a facial cleaner, and it's so funny. I got this from Birchbox too, and it's actually a couple of Birchbox products I'm going to show you. But this is a cleanser. It is the DDF Doctors Term Derm I can't even talk. Dermological Formula Brightening Cleanser. And this is really awesome. And this is a larger size that came with Burst Box that I like. Excuse me, guys. My hair looks terrible. But anyway, this cleanser, and it has a little thing like this on it. This has helped my complexion. Like I said before in my last video, I have really dry skin. So this has worked out really well for me. And another little product that I got from Birch Box is from Benefit. And I'm going to probably buy a bigger one, but this is a It's Potent Eye Cream. And I love it. It's just like a little cream. I don't want to show you my nails. My nails are terrible right now. But it's a little eye cream. And it has helped my dark circles. So that's what it looks like. And this is going into household products that I like. And I want to show you a candle from um, Bath and Body Works. But, yeah. But it's called Sparkling Night. No, oh, Sparkling Night. Twinkling Night. And that's the candle right there. And it kind of smells. And I'll read the description because I'm bad with smells. But. It's an inspired shimmering fragrance to set the scene for the perfect holiday feat. Luscious blackberry and sweet nectar layered with notes of dark woods and patchouli. And I love patchouli, so this is nice. I doubt they have it because it was during the holidays, but that's where eBay comes into play. If you want to find it, it's pretty awesome. And I burn it in my bathroom, so... The last thing that I do want to show you right now, and I don't know, look, get it on my hand. I don't know if a lot of, in your area, you have Dollar Tree. And I, I shop there a lot, and everything is literally a dollar, but this is a hand wash that I like, but it's Healing Waters, Green Apple, Scented Perfume, Perfume, whatever, hand wash. And it's apple, and it literally smells like apple. It's pretty awesome, and I love it. So, I'm almost done. I bought it for both of our bathrooms, and it's like gives off a little fresh scent, and I love it. So, if you do have a Dollar Tree near you, get the Green Apple Healing Waters Hand Wash. I was going to say sanitizer, but no. Hand Wash. So, take a sip of my coffee. I know I'm drinking coffee in my bathroom. How odd is that? Anyway, I would do an outfit of the day, but because I'm recording in my bathroom, I can't do that. But I will show you some things. This necklace is actually from my grandma who passed away two years ago. She gave me all of her jewelry. I don't know what brand it is, but I love it. It's pretty cool. You can see it's got little crystals on there. And then this cardigan. I think I got it from like... Urban Outfitters a while back. It's kind of got the little puffy sleeves. And this is just like a tank top with another black layer tank top under it. And then my typical bracelets I wear all the time. My little hair tie band. This little bobble bracelet that I love with the little crystals. And then just a standard little metal bracelet here. So anyway, and I'm wearing black tights. And black flat. So that was my outfit for the day. And me and my daughter basically just hung out today. And just went window shopping. And did a little this and that. So it was my mommy Monday. When we're usually by ourselves. So oh I got one more thing I want to show you. This I actually have not tried yet. But I want to use it. And that's where it comes in. I want to ask you. African American ladies out there if you've tried this yet because I'm not sure if it'll work. It says for all hair types, but this macadamia um, Healing oil treatment and this actually once again came in birch box 
And I actually have seen in a lot of girls' videos. Well, apparently it's pretty expensive, so I want to try it. So if you have tried this on your hair, please let me know if it works. I want to know if it works before I try it because I have horrible hair. So the macadamia, and this has been on everybody's videos. So let me know if it works before I do it. And leave a comment below to let me know if I should try it and if you think it will work. So this video according to my timer that i'm looking at right now is about 15 minutes long so i'm going to go but i do want to say hello to you guys and you probably will see a lot of my videos coming on mondays a lot of them unfortunately will be in my car because when i'm home it's always baby and hubby time so but i do want to say that i hope you enjoy my favorites and if you want to leave comments below to say hello and welcome me back to youtube please do so and please subscribe thank you so much for people who have that have prescribed prescribed that have subscribed and i do appreciate it and please leave a comment and say hello i'm welcome to say hello to everyone and i love making new friends and saying hello to everybody so please stop by subscribe like the video if you like it and if you want to tell me your favorite beauty products, please do. I welcome all of those and a few things that I can try, please. I love trying a lot of different things. And before I keep rambling, which is 16 minutes now, I'm going to say goodbye. And you guys have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.